What's going on guys, Boat here, welcome to a quick live video. So, before I start this video, what I would like to say is there will be a few FPS drops during this video. I can't really record record quick live that well with Fraps, it does drop my FPS a lot, so I apologise for those moments, but yeah. Overall, another thing I'd like to say is I was actually in a TeamSpeak at the same time, so you may hear some of the TeamSpeak audio in the background. I didn't actually notice at the time, but apart from all that, welcome to the video. So today, probably one of my best games on um, Quick Live that I've actually had so far, but overall for Quick Live, this is the kind of the only server I play at the moment. I'm trying to practice, like when it comes to Quick Live, I want to try to practice all the guns so I can get good at each gun, so I can kind of put them all together to play really well. So I play in a railgun server. Maybe it's not the best one to learn like how to use the railgun, but I believe it's um, it's better than nothing for a practicing. So in the background, you'll see the uh, the final three minutes or so of the um, of the game that I'm about. To, well, the game that I'm actually doing right now, which is actually a really good score. I actually now I've played this server and I've played maybe fifty odd games of this only this server, which is a railgun freeze tag. Just for those who actually play the game, I've never seen anybody get over a hundred points on it. So I was pretty happy when I actually when I actually got it in this game. But my kill to death ratio was also fantastic along with my four, so I was really happy with this. So I decided to pull up fraps right at the end and just record the last five minutes or so of the game so that I could upload it to YouTube because I think some people may want to well some people might actually enjoy this. Um but yeah, overall for those who um actually just don't care about any other games, then of course you can close out this if you want to. But if you honestly like kind of like the look of this game, this game is going to be the game I play when I quit RuneScape. I can almost guarantee that. This is a game that I would love to get good at because it is a skill-based game where if you are a skilled player in here, of course you can get beat by other people, but when it comes down to the skill-based games, you need to be good. Like, if you put me against somebody who is um, one of the best in the world, I probably wouldn't even kill them once. Now, I did have a huge debate on my live stream about how this is about the same skill-based as COD. Personally, I do not agree with that in the slightest. If you are skilled at this game, you will dominate almost any server you join. Call of Duty is just completely different, so I don't really like to compare them, but I don't want to cause an argument out of it. If you think this is the same, that's completely fine by me, but overall, the gameplay itself, in a railgun server, it's not really... The gameplay isn't that impressive. I mean, obviously, I didn't really get the start of the game. The start of the game was absolutely beautiful. The amount of kills I was getting was absolutely... It was just insane. I was going around like, oh, where's my fraps on here? And then I noticed that my score was almost at 100, so I was getting quite happy. So I decided to pull it up to record the end. And I was actually playing with a few subscribers, and the guy I just shot there was actually one of them. I believe I had about two or three of my subscribers in this game, which is really fun. It's honestly really fun to play with subscribers. So it's always cool to see you here. For those that um, have joined the servers before, then this is actually the server that I currently only play. Of course, when I get around to getting better with the guns, I will adapt into the more skillful service to get good from there, but at the moment I like to practice the railgun. Now, this part of the gameplay is absolutely horrendous. Please, just don't even judge me here. It was horrible, but overall, you'll see at the end the score that I got, and then you can also see the accolades I achieved with the impressives and the, the fours and all that, but yeah. And overall, how it works... Thawing gives you twice as many points as actually shooting someone, so that's different as well. But like I said, my kill to death ratio was actually really good this game. So it's about wrapping the uh, video up there. I believe this is the end. I don't think I get forward, but as you saw there, I got 64 kills and 15 deaths. I don't really know the accolades, but we'll see those at the end. But yeah, a lot of this video is more of um like I've been wanting to try and get Quick Live up for a while. I was really happy when I found out that I could actually record Quick Live, but yeah, now that I've got it, I can actually do it. So as you can see here, 48% accuracy, 17 excellence, 21 fours, 21 impressions, one humiliation. Brilliant game, really enjoyed it. Don't think I'll ever get one as good as that for a long time, but like I said, I'm practicing. So thank you for watching, guys, and I shall see you all soon. And I have Evolution of Boaty Epistay number six coming out later today and a live stream, so stay tuned.